So, so what we're going to do, all right, I just need to make sure I'm remembering this because I, I look at students that ask me about their grade and then I remember looking at what they're doing when I was going over and explaining things and I see that they're just staring down at their phone. There you go. So what I have, ladies and gentlemen, is just remember there's two things we've talked about. Log base b of x equals y. We learned how to convert that to exponential form, right? And go from exponential to logarithmic. Yes? That's something we learned. OK. Then the next thing, what the other thing we learned, I won't go through the formula, but we said that if 2 equals x and then 2 equals y, then we know that since they have the same base, that x equaled y, right? So we spent two days talking about those topics. Now what I'm asking you to do is say, hey, tell me the value of x in this equation. And guess what? We're now going to apply what we've already previously learned. All right. So first of all, let's see if we can apply this. Do I have exponents and bases right now? Do, I, do you guys see this? Do I have exponent and bases right now in my equation? No. So probably applying this is probably not going to be helpful, right? Do you kind of agree with that? But can I apply transferring from exponential to logarithmic with this? This is in what form, logarithmic or exponential? Logarithmic, because it has our log. So what do you think we might be able to do from what we've learned? What could we try? Let's try it to exponential form. So if I rewrite this in exponential form, this would be 6 to the 3x equals 216. Yes? OK. Now, how did we learn how to solve equations when we have exponents? We need to make sure they have the same base, right? So this is a base 6. This does not have a base 6. However, can we rewrite this as a base 6? Can you rewrite 216 as 6 to some number? Right? So let's see. 6 to the first equals 6. 6 squared equals 36. 6 cubed equals 216. So therefore, I say 6 to the 3x equals 6 to the third power. Now that I rewrote it like this, can I now apply this problem? It's right there. That's the easy problem. That's it. So now all we're doing, guys, I know you guys like get up.